pranam to all how are you i hope you are all fine roses can provide us with so much beauty and joy do you also love roses like me In our garden we have some plants which are rose plants so today i will be talking about these beautiful rose plants only so today i will tell you some tips and these tips will help you help your roses and hopefully lead to some beautiful memories of your own Before these tips first you need to choose wisely that what roses do you want In my opinion the most important of these is disease resistance rose plant One of them is desi rose you can easily grow them Second tip that give them what they need for proper growing Generally speaking, roses require at least 6 hours of full sun a day. And for soil, give them a well-drained, nutrient-rich soil and moderate amount of water. Water should only be applied directly to the root zone, not the leaf surface. Third tip is prune for structure. If you prune time to time your plants will become very healthy as it is the last week of September prune it really well so you can get a lots of flowers and in order to get lots of flowers you need to give your plant some special fertilizers so in today's video i will be telling you about some special dye rose fertilizers and remedies to make your plants grow healthy and strong first fertilizer my mom is giving is the mustard seed powder fertilizer if you don't have mustard seed powder fertilizer you can also use mustard cake mustard cake or mustard seed powder is a fertilizer that can be used for flowering and vegetable plants mustard seed fertilizer is rich in protein and provides micronutrients to your rose plant it can also help your rose plant prevent any diseases and promote healthy growth You all know before applying any fertilizer there should be taking of the soil. It helps in the aeration of the plant and also more absorption of the fertilizer from the plant. Did you know that mustard cake powder or mustard seed powder contains essential elements for plant growth such as nitrogen, phosphorus, potassium etc it can be mixed with soil to reach the deep roots which can make the flowers bigger and leaves shinier you can either give it as dry mustard seed fertilizer or make it into a tea and then give it to your plant as a liquid fertilizer I hope you all know how to make tea but if not today I am going to tell you how do you make mustard seed tea Mustard cake powder can be used to make fertilizer tea which can be used to irrigate plants to make fertilizer tea you can soak 100 g of mustard cake in 1 liter of water and let it brew for 3 to 4 days After four days dilute the solution and give it to your plants. The next fertilizer that you can give your plant is the banana peel fertilizer. And then add the eggshell. Eggshell has great calcium boost, speeds up the overall growth of the plant and promotes bigger blooms. 
Meanwhile, the banana peel fertilizer gives your plant more flowers for better growth and improve root structure. The next thing I'm going to tell you is very effective and will work so good if you give to your plant. Yes, you guessed it right. It is the fish blood. If you apply this fertilizer, it will promote lush growth in days. Thank you for watching this video. Stay safe, stay healthy. Bye-bye.